It is day seven, and we're waking up in Monterra of Mertana today. Uh, lots of things to do, but let's just talk to the rest of the people so we figure if out what's you want happening. To buy weapons or learn smithing from me, you'll have to pay for it, Mora. Hmm. But what if he has arrows? I don't want to pay 500 gold and then find out he doesn't have arrows. Everything all right? <sighs> Working for that fat orc Thorek is really tough going. Okay. There is strength in rest. There is strength in rest. I can concur. Well. We uh, need wheat for this dude. Merrick. What about the hut next to your house? That old shack, you mean? You can have it if you like. No one's been living there for ages. We have a house. Alright. Take my advice. The elites. No, oh, this you must have things of your own to take care of. Have you come to mock me too? What is with your face? What's eating you? Seems like you haven't heard about Oh, it's tattooed. Out. I come from the desert and was traveling through the land with my caravan. Those cursed rebel dogs ambushed me outside the city and took everything. What did you have? Valuables, rarities, luxuries, artifacts and jewelry. What misery. If at least I had my old gold casket. It is of inestimable personal value to me. Here is your old gold casket. It was still lying in the road to the west with your other stuff. You son of a dog! That is fantastic! I will richly reward you for this, my pale friend. You're almost as pale. I don't know what you're talking about. Tell me more about your artifacts. I know what the orcs are seeking. Why they are digging throughout the land, hoping to find it. The divine artifacts of the Ancient Ones, my pale friend. And I swear to you, I held one of them in my hands. But now it is gone, and out of my reach. Forever. What is this? What do you know about the divine artifacts? You mean, other than the fact that the orcs are looking for them like mad? They are of inestimable value on the open market. That alone is enough. How did you get a divine artifact? Let me put it this way, my pale friend. While others perish in the sands of the desert in the sweat of their brow, I used my head. Or plainly, I was simply faster than the others. Who has the divine artifact now? Are you listening to me at all? The rebels ambushed me. If anyone knows, it is those cursed royalists. Show me your goods. The royalists. I mean, I don't give a shit about the king. After all, it was his decree that put us in prison, but... You know, orcs are enslaving people. Fuck that. You don't have arrows, you sad bastard. Is there anything here besides booze? Depends on what you need. Every piece of information costs five gold coins. Although we could just trade. What'll it be? Hmm. Is there any work to be had here? A fighter like you should join the mercenaries. That's probably best for you. And makes you a lot of gold. The real fat cats in the city, of course, are the orcs. But for that, you have to be tolerated inside the castle by the orcs. Tell me something about this city. Monterra is a trading city, and how could it be otherwise occupied by the orcs? But the orcs mostly stay inside the castle. The orcs' mercenaries rule the outer districts of Monterra. This is the merchant quarter of the city, but don't expect too much. Since the orcs started digging up the whole city, very few merchants have found their way to Monterra. Mm. Who leads the orcs in this city? His name is Varric. So far, I haven't laid eyes on him myself. 
Up to now, he hasn't come out of the inner castle yard. Tell me more about the excavations. Wherever there are ruins of the ancient ones left, the orcs dig up everything they can find. Who knows what they're looking for? I've heard that meanwhile, there are excavations like this in almost every city. How do you get along with the mercenaries? Well, so-so. Marek is the leader of the troop. If the boys cause any trouble, Marek gives them a rap on the knuckles. Show me your goods. God damn it. How many picks do I need? Ah, more can't hurt. Read you this perfect trade. There we go. Alright. The music is on like 22%, and it's still kinda loud. That's ridiculous. Right, Let it go. Otherwise, we'll get in trouble. Have I done everything here? That'll never get anywhere. Uh, we need wheat. We need stone roots. Wait, it's still they can't go on like this. The meek, the tired mercenary. Hmm. Stay out of it. And find the stray wolves. All right. Well, let's go to the other side of town. Oh, that's a wall. Alright, well. How do we get there? There's a wall the other way too, so I guess we just have to go around? I guess we'll do everything while we're at it. More rebels. Stop making such a commotion, or the orcs will spot us. What is your mission? I'm looking for a way to get rid of the slave camp guards so that we can help the slaves. But unfortunately, the orcs will raise the alarm as soon as they notice anything suspicious. We don't stand a chance fighting them in the open. There are just too many of them. You rebels are dangerously close to the city. We would take the whole place by storm if we could. But unfortunately, the orcs outnumber us. We probably wouldn't even make it to the temple complex. We already had one of our men infiltrate the orc mercenaries, but somehow he hasn't achieved much so far. Too many orcs in the slave camp? We can change that. And just how, Mr. Know-it-all? If those slave camp guards come running all at once, we're done for. One would have to pick them off one by one. Hmm. Who is your spy among the mercenaries? If I tell you that, I might as well give myself up to the orcs right now. First, I would need some proof that I can trust you. What's the problem with your spy among the mercenaries? We've done a lot of damage to the city lately. The orcs haven't noticed, but the mercenaries have become more cautious. Therefore, I assume that our spy is lying low so he won't blow his cover. I will think of something to lure the slave camp guards away. <laughs> Those orcs are better at using axes than their brains. But they aren't that stupid either. Wait and see. Now this will be worth watching. Can I take these? Okay, good. I need them for someone else. Like how it says bundle of weapons received, not you picked up a bundle of weapons. I guess it's in case it's showing up for the dialogue of trading with someone else as well. Like, conversationally. Stray wolf. What? Well, we found our wolf problem. So totally by accident. Damn it. Aha! Just loose it in time. Okay. Ah, oh. oh, shit! It got hung up on the crystal, but then it moved. Eh. 
Fuck, I gotta go. I gotta go bad. Help! Can we eat more meat? Is it still following me? There. The music fades out way too fast, I find. It fades in and fades out very quickly. A little disorienting at times. Like, do, 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 and then just... Moment's over. It's passed. Better be over it by now, because we are. How many wolves are down here? Yeah, look at that. Oh shit. Gonna have to run. That will kill me quick. Uh -oh. Run away. Oh, into a blood fly. Dodge. Yeah. Alright. I like how they turn to white wolves instead of the brown wolves from the earlier games. Like, it just baffles me that they decided to change the complete look of all the creatures rather than at least keeping them within the same... Like, I get changing the art style because the graphical engine changed, but... Like, changing... Even, like, the concept of how they look as opposed to just, you know, the details. Yeah, we got them all. Go loot the cave. Hopefully something good's inside. Just demon mushrooms. And I assume demon mushrooms are... Ooh, there's two steel chests. Metal chests. I don't know why I call them steel. Oh, this is just a regular chest. Never mind. Hush my mouth. Arrows. That's a nice sword. Wenzel's sword. Wenzel. Wenzel. Oh, like as in the paladin. Holy shit, it is blessed. Look at all that damage. Huh. Too bad we're not using swords. What if later we get a quest from Ren? Oh, you know what? I bet you after we free uh, Cape Dunn, Wenzel says, oh, I need my sword. I have his sword. Too bad I can't give it to him ahead of time and say, hey, I found your sword. Want to use this to liberate the city? That would be too much fun. Is this the other way? I think this is the other path to come here. Bandits. That's why it was more dangerous. Okay, well, we gotta get to the wheat field. Take care of the wolves so we can go talk to the guys on the stock farm, livestock farm. I gotta find a way to lure the orcs out. Pick them off. Starting to get low on arrows. It's not a good time. As far as I can tell, nobody in the city will sell me arrows. Maybe that orc will sell them to me, but he wants 500 bloody gold. I'm gonna be pissed if I pay him that and then he doesn't have anything.
Alright. Is there anything else worth killing here? The Shrine of Belia. I can't make this guy go, can I? Now for a peaceful little smoke. If I kill him, will I fail the quest or will it achieve the quest? That's what I'd like to know. I'm going to fuck over my playthrough for that though. I should save. Fuck the Dennis, I think it was. Don't you have anything to do? This guy. The stray wolves have been eliminated. You mean I can relax now? Sure looks like it. That's a comfort thought. Good job. Here's your reward. Let me think. 500 gold's respectable. I can get behind that. Oh, the other farms are over here. Cool. It's been a while. More rebels. Son of a bitch, they got them surrounded. You wouldn't happen to be one of the mercenaries, would you? What? Probably not. Otherwise, you'd have killed me, wouldn't you? Who are you? I'm Mason. I'm a rebel. I've surrounded the stockyard with my people. We're just waiting for the sign to attack. Surrounded? What are you talking about? We rebels are everywhere. You should know. Even if you can't always see us. Anyway, we control the whole valley here. Well, well. What in the world are you planning? First, we'll sort out the livestock. <laughs> Just wait. It'll be fun. What livestock do you want to kill? Well, the fat cows in the stockyard. If the mercenaries don't have anything left to eat, they're bound to give up quickly. I see. I'll take care of the cows in the stockyard. What? Really? That would be fantastic. You'll see. The mercenaries will give up soon once the cattle are dead. We'll see. What about the pigs? They aren't so important. They don't give milk. I see. You are completely nuts. You know that? If you think it's easy to kill the cows, you'd better think again. Those bastards keep a closer eye on their animals than on their purses. Well, we'll see. Who's going to give you the sign to attack? We've planted a spy in Monterra. He'll inform us when it's time to strike. I suspect it's the guy with the storehouse. I don't remember. Oh, huh, there's bison. Bison burgers, anyone? You'll find the rest of their men. Oh yeah, I never found the teleportation route. I need that. Oh shit, that is a beast. Well, that sucked. Fuck! How am I supposed to deal if half of my arrows don't do anything, hmm? We got him. Chest. Huh, this is all very broken down looking. Although there's something over there and there's something over there. Let's check this side out first. Where are the woodcutters? Hmm? Nah, okay. Fuck. Thanks. Get it. Can't wait until I deal more damage.
I do need the teleportation rune first though. Steal all your stuff. Nothing in here, huh? That's all you need. Mercenaries, Rufus. Hey you. You look different from the others here. You don't work for the orc mercenaries, do you? Hmm. And if I were? All right. Then I didn't say anything. You are one of the slaves, aren't you? Unfortunately. That wasn't always the case. But today, there isn't much choice. Who are you looking for? I must get out of here. But the mercenaries are, are watching my every step. I need someone strong who can distract them while I make a run for it. Maybe I can help you. I have to get to Okara, and as fast as possible. The rebels are waiting for me there. I have a very important message for them. What sort of message for the rebels? <sighs> Forget it. I was careless enough telling you about it at all. All right, I'll get you out of here. How are you going to do that? Later. You look important. What is it? Are you unhappy with your pay as well? Go back to work. Slow down. I'm not one of your people. Then what do you want here? I'm busy. If I don't watch out, the slaves will take off and the boys will just hang around and be idle. Some things will never change. Take my advice. Yeah. Slaves are escaping from your farm? Yes, damn it. Go ahead and rub it in. Not enough that this Marek is constantly after me. My own people are making fun of me now. Tell me about Merrick. He is an orc mercenary, just like me. Merrick is our leader here in Montera. He sees to it that everybody works and doesn't just do what they damn well want to. I'd like to know how he does that. I can't even handle the handful of people here on the farm. I think you may need my help. Oh, damn. I have a feeling that I'm going to regret this. First, show me what you've got. Then maybe I'll think about it. Someday this will be yours. Hmm. Are you serious? You should get your lads going somehow. Light a fire under them. Great suggestion. The only thing that could motivate them now is alcohol. We're either going to be stabbed by grain thieves or overrun by the undead from the castle to the east. Some things will never change. What? Did you just say undead? If you follow the path to the east, it will take you to the old paladin stronghold. It's nothing but ruins these days, but still inhabited. If you get my drift, I wouldn't go too close to the castle if I were you. What about the rebels? The royalists are lying low in the mountains or hanging around outside of Montera. The rebels aren't a serious threat. The grain thieves up north are more cause for worry. They will come at night and steal those sacks of wheat right from under our noses. I'm halfway expecting to wake up with a slashed throat while my own people are snoring in the hay, sleeping off a hangover. I will take care of the grain thieves. You want to do what my people haven't accomplished in weeks? Ha! Go ahead. I want to see that. Will do. Now, where are your sacks of wheat? You need 15 of them. Presumably the green thieves have the rest of them anyway. Someday this will be yours. Kind of weird that you would just leave the wheat just lying around wherever the fuck and not in like, say, a specific organized area. Is that it? Keep all your grain outside where it can get rained on. Ah, 
Okay, he said the green thieves are to the north. And the undead are to the east. This is like the craziest slow ass jump. It's a very odd animation. And also much higher than a normal human can jump. More like a folly animation than a jumping animation. Shit, those are snappers. See, they're like the least intimidating looking thing ever. Um, are the green thieves up here? Those. Don't really want to fight them because I don't know how tough they are. And I just assume they're fast still, but I don't know that. God damn it. I'm surrounded by the look of it. How far are the green thieves? Hmm? Well. I got it. Guess I just keep going until I find something. Getting wolves. I'm gonna need armor. I'm not gonna be able to afford everything I want. I want a new bow, and I want armor. Shit. It'd be really cool if there was like, a map that told me where exactly the green thieves were. Not just, yep, yeah, they're up to the north somewhere. All right. Now, is that just no, what the fuck? A malicious ripper beast. Well, clearly those have some significance, but I'm going to get the quest first. Eh. Oh, shit. These must be the undead to the east. Now we're north, if anything. And these are the trolls. They're very weird looking, aren't they? Got like a stumpy head. We won't be engaging them. I don't have the arrows for that shit. I barely have the arrows to manage normal life. Chomp! they don't care are so good Shit. I'll tear your head. ah we found them there is a lot of them I'll show you there's a lot of snappers around guys oh good they're gonna help me What the fuck kind of voice is that? <laughs> that is the ugliest voice I've ever heard in my life. Like a Skeksis. <laughs> Oh, you guys are fucked. You showed him. Yeah. Gotcha. Are they killing them? 
Not successfully. Ah, sounds like they are. Somewhat. Well, I'm happy for the snappers, because otherwise this would actually be difficult. Run away! Damn it. Shielded bastards. Stop right there. Now. Gotcha. Okay. Well, we had a lot of help from the snappers. I appreciated it. I think they killed a whole bunch of them now. That's unfortunate, but... Oh well. It's just XP. Is that enough? Would you stop that? Would you stop that? As if I was shooting, like, spitballs at them. Like, would you stop that? I have an arrow in my chest, but could you please stop it? Fuck. Stop right there. Gotcha. Shit. Missing with these harbor guys is a big deal. They got so much bloody range. Should be most of you guys. No, it is yours. So I have arrows and you have a halberd. You should really be carrying a bow. Gotcha. Now, give me the grain. Wheat. Wheat sacks. Got a little cave here, huh? Ah, I have 15 out of 15, but there's an extra one here. That is kind of a nice kindness. We'll leave one extra, just in case you miss one. If you happen to be, like, visually challenged. You can kill these lizards, but... Uh, normally I would, but I'm not going to waste arrows on them. Alright, what do we got in here? Mine crawlers, mine crawlers. Anything else? Just lots of those guys, huh? You know what? I only have 69 arrows. This is a bad idea. I've just decided. Maybe we should have enough arrows to, you know, do anything before I waste them. Because chances are I'm not going to get enough to make it worth my while, if I get any at all. Out of chests, I mean, the minecrawlers aren't going to have arrows. We are now sub 100 arrows. It's getting a little bit desperate. We could be right fucked. What now? No! I don't wanna! Leave me alone. There's 
another one of those damn another one of those beasts. Um, you may could get it. Maybe I'll take the last hit. Well done. There, I got it. Thanks for your help, guys. Just a slave, just a slave. Stone metal. Right, we need 20 stone root. I think I'm gonna have to kill that one guy. I don't know if there's any other way around it. To kill the cows. All right. Oh, maybe this guy will trade with me. It doesn't matter to you. Here are your sacks of wheat. Well, finally, here is a bit of gold for your service. Show me your goods. <sighs> no goddamn arrows. Actually, here, trade me miscellaneous Show crap. Me your goods. I want your money. All of those... Shit, I don't have any spells. Need to find someone else. Hmm. Round it out with booze. There. Okay, now where do you think I find the rune? Oh. <laughs> of course it's on this table. We woke up right next to it and I didn't even notice. Fucking stupid. Alright, well at least I can come back anytime I want. Now that that's the case, let's go back... ...to Cape Dunn. We'll talk to our friend, the hunter. Get our hunting skill up, and then we'll get a better bow. And maybe one day I'll be able to afford armor. We can't afford the revolution. We don't have enough arrows. We can talk to Wenzel though. Teach me something about hunting. That's the way. Carry on. Carry on. Uh huh. Okay. And now. All right, I don't want the game hunter stuff because it doesn't really matter. Show me your goods. Ah, uh, you do have the better bow. Fuck, thirteen grand. I'm never gonna be able to afford armor, am I? But making these things cheaper on myself is probably gonna be the way. What am I going to want to transform into a boar or a scavenger, hmm? Never. Ooh, but I can give you all my skins, because you'll give me extra money for those. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. There. <laughs> Fuck. Let's start off from the beginning again, but at least at least I can deal more damage now. That's a big old bonus. Means I'll lose Less arrows. Should have probably pushed to do that before I set out to count the grain thieves, if I'm honest. I have not been doing this optimally, and I'm really hoping it doesn't bite me in the ass. 
Let's talk to Wenzel and see if he wants his sword. I'm betting probably not. But just in case. Gonna be fucked. I talked to Wenzel. Excellent. And? Will he help with the revolution? I assume so. Very good. Then go and make him your comrade in arms. I shall mobilize the rest of the city. We will help you when you take the battle to the orcs. Hmm. How exactly does this revolution work? As soon as you start fighting the orcs, we will know that the time has come. And remember, we only have a chance of success if you kill the leader of the orcs in the city. I see. Oh, that's a lot of pressure. I need more arrows for that. Oh, he's become hostile. Show me your goods. But he has arrows. Which is everything I dreamed of. Well, this bow is worth 800? Fuck yes. They're on to me. You dealt with Ortega's bandits. That was quite a feat. I'll give you a bonus for that. Nice. We've kicked things off for sure. We still need more arrows. It's not even enough to care about. I'm Gamma. sure you've still got things to do. Leave These me people. alone. Oh, gonna die. So, how do you propose we raise enough fucking gold now, hmm? Who this guy isn't a mercenary. It's not dressed like one. Show me your goods. Oh, hey, did he replenish arrows? We might have enough arrows for a revolution. Shit, except I don't have armor still. Uh, it's gonna be... That's gonna be a tough one. I have five grand. I could technically get some armor. I really wanted the 20,000 gold one, though. That would have been so much better to me. Shall we try? I got enough time to start a revolution, don't I? Fuck walking 20 feet. I can teleport. Put down your weapon. Don't cause any more trouble here. Oh, don't worry. There will be much trouble caused. Make him my combat in arms. Comrade in arms. Go talk to him. What do you want? I want to talk. The underground will support us. Let's fight now. Then what are we waiting for? Follow me. I will fight to the death. I will smash you. I to will crush you like a worm. Well, this isn't going well. Oh boy. Drink, 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 drink. Oh. 
This revolution thing might be better for a later game, I think. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, I didn't die. I'm gonna let you have it. Let's kill the leader while we're down here. Can I get on the roof? Yeah. Ha ha ha! Oh no! No! You will die. Oh shit. Oh boy. Let's leave the city. We'll take it from the outside. Come on, Silas. Well, the slaves are getting murdered. Not a whole lot we can do about that. Shit. You get a halberd. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. All right, the army's after me, so I'm gonna drink a potion. I'll tear you apart. Is he a rebel? If you kill you Yen, move the mouse. Okay, if we just get far enough away from Yen's, he won't die, right? He's my favorite hunter. Yeah, in the city I was powerless, but out here... I can aggro you forever. Ow, you are tough. Okay. Just for you. Gotcha. Oh, that armor kind of sucks, doesn't it, buddy? Shit. Uh-oh. Did you guys kill Jens? Jens? Gotcha. I'm gonna be so pissed off. At the rate they're coming, I suspect the answer is yes. Yes, yes. Better not have killed Yens. Now Did you fuckers kill Yens? No, they didn't. Good. Okay, you can come after me all you want. As long as you didn't kill my friend. I'm gonna let you, have it. you know, considering how much more damage this bow does, it doesn't seem to be helping as much as it should. It does considerably more damage. Oh boy. Man, where are they all coming from? I really hope they didn't kill Wenzel. They just seem to like randomly come out of the city and go, yeah, we're gunning for you now. Drink a potion, drink a potion, drink a potion. This is a lot of juggling. Circle running, circle. Not really circle strafing. Gotcha. Yeah. 
We already got the leader. Shit. God damn it. Where are you guys coming from? It's a good thing you guys can't lead your shots at all. Otherwise I'd be in serious danger. See what a head knock arrow does. I'm just curious now. now it's your turn. Ha! It does knock him down. Now it's your turn. Stop right there, Mora. No. I'm winning this fight. Sort of. Even though more of you keep joining it. You will die. Fuck. Mm. Seriously. Like more and more on the horizon. Fuck. Just gonna keep doing the same strategy. It's working. Okay. Kill that one. One less guy shooting. This fight won't take long. Man, my face hurts. I am scrunching up my face so much with this. Just because I'm anticipating getting sliced right up. Okay. He's low on health. Stop right there, Mora. Okay, I'm not sure why I went through that guy that I was targeting. Gotta kill the mercenaries, because they're definitely faster moving than the orcs. And as soon as you down one, they move way faster for a little bit. It's just like, oh, he's not fucking around, we gotta go. Uh, I'm glad that I got more arrows for the revolution. Partially from you. I bought them off of you, Ukras. Killing you with your own supply. Where are you fucks going? You think you can escape me? It's fine. Where's the leader? Revolution. Ashishi knives. We did it. Revolution. And now I'm going to spend the rest of the day looting. All these men with names. They decided to side with the orcs. The bastard sword. It's a good sword. It's got lots of range. Lots of damage. Is that it? Can't be all of it, can it? Hmm. The vast majority, anyway. Alright, let's go see who's still alive. Jens is still kicking. He's the one I cared about the most.
At least they kept the orc weapons looking similar-ish to what they did. One plus. Oh, the dead slaves. The guys didn't make it. Sadness. Yeah, the slaves definitely didn't make it. Did Wenzel make it? There's a good question. Place is so dead now. Oh, good. Saruk is still alive. I'm glad you weren't one of them. That was a complete success. Cape Dunn is free. Thanks, stranger. I shall include you in my prayers. Take this. It should help you on your way. Two healing potions. Yeah, I just had like seven or eight of them, but all right. Just tell me when's I'll still alive. I think leaving him saved him. Yeah. Cape Dunn is now free, and so are you. Thank you. Without your help, they certainly would have killed me. I will continue to strengthen the resistance here. Every city we reconquer will empower the king. And one more thing. If you ever go to Monterra, look for a wolf cave south of the city. There you will find a sword. It has never let me down. I hid it there before Gamel took me prisoner. If you bring it back to me, you won't regret it. Here you go. I have your sword. Really? Let me see. Thank you, friend. Let me reward your service. All in a day's work. Well, I guess we can go check to see if there's any other heavy chests, because I think they're free game now. Bundle of weapons. I don't remember where I got the idea, but I feel like bundles of weapons are something that you need a lot of later. I already looted this place. Um, let's go to the head orc's place. Looted that. Ooh, there was swords. I can sell those. so many wolf furs. Ah, now I can read. And Enos spoke to the Eternal Wanderer. Lay aside your staff, and in its stead, Enos gave him the scepter, and the Eternal Wanderer became his servant. Anything else? No. Those skins cannot be had. Unfortunately, the head knock arrow doesn't keep them down long enough to really warrant using it. Unless you're purely just trying to support people. Playing this on two player would be awesome. I was told supposedly there was a two player mod for this, but I couldn't find anything related to it, so. If anyone does happen to track it down, maybe link it to me. Okay, well, I think that's about it. That's all we got. Ooh, maybe up top here. Be something here. Upstairs of your house. Uh, I already looted this. Here's I have, and I just forgot about it. Well, I think that's as good a point as any to wrap up this episode. So yeah, day seven and we have already freed a town. I guess technically we started the game by freeing a town, but that that was supposed to happen. There was no way to lose that fight. So this is the first one for real Z's. One small step for mankind. All right, we'll continue on tomorrow. So until then, take care. Have a good one.